Right, we are back. Ready. We have these memories that we can do now. We can check back on memories. It only has 10 coins, but I don't really feel the need to look back. I don't know. Right. Let's do this. Where are we off? We're off to the training grounds, I believe. That's the quick pitch. To the training grounds. Let's see Madam Hooch, who is gonna tell us off, probably. We're gonna face the consequences. Do you think we'll get detention? I've never had detention before. I don't care whether we're in trouble. They had it coming. Hooch is overacting. Not a real fight unless it ends with a broken nose. I have not seen such behaviour on the Quidditch pitch since the infamous brawl of 1972. And after the row following your friendly, it's clear that all of you need a lesson in consequences. Both of your teams will be suspended from the Quidditch Cup, effective immediately. What? You can't ban us from playing Quidditch. I think you'll find I can, most Pat Mahakin. You may compete in house matches once you prove your dedication to sportsmanship and cooperation. How do we do that, Madam Hooch? Until further notice, all 14 of you will participate in detention together. That doesn't leave much time for Quidditch practice. You may resume practice if you complete your first detention with a minimal amount of argument. Today, all of you will tend to Hogwarts broomsticks. Hop to it. Lovely. More detention. Just when we thought we finally got out, they pull us back in in another quest. The sooner we stop arguing, the sooner we can play Quidditch. Arguing won't get us anywhere. Wish our teams could see that. Right, well. We've got to work together. Well, Madam Hooch won't let us play Quidditch. I can't believe we're suspended. I just got back on the team. Collective punishment is completely unfair. Well, it was a collective argument. I'd rather snog the giant, seeker, giant squid than this. I think this is the first broom I used in my first flying lesson. First, first. Not sure shooting stars are worth the maintenance. This is exactly like flying class. Wait a minute. It is flying class. Okay, we're on repeat now. All the way. Oh. Right, let's finish this off. Da -da -da. Da -da -da. Jeez, it's a long three hours. Done. Finished. Success. We've repaired all the broomsticks, Madam Hooch. Well done. It seems the 14 of you can work together. Have we proved ourselves that proved to you a dedicated sportsmanship and cooperation? It's a start. You will have more opportunity to demonstrate the true spirit of Quidditch. While you still need to earn your place in the Quidditch competition with the Quidditch play Cup, both teams may resume Quidditch practice. Thank you, Madam Hooch. Doesn't seem fair. We didn't pick a fight. We didn't stop them either. It's either we're still responsible. I suppose this is the sort of thing a Quidditch captain often has to resolve. But Orion isn't here. We don't have a captain right now. What about you? Do you think banning both teams for the hardest match is fair, Shaney? Yeah, I think it's fair. Without Ryan, we're responsible for the Quidditch team. Thinking like a captain, Hunter. Sounds like something Ryan would say. Team unity and so on. Which probably means you're right. What do we do about it? Well, we'll have to prove our teams can work together before we're allowed to play proper Quidditch practices. Matches. I'll talk to my team. Doubt they'll feel cooperative at the moment. Shaney and I will talk to the Gryffindor team. They used to, used to use a bit of cheering up. Could use. Then it's settled. To get back at the, to playing Quidditch, we rally our teams to cooperate in the next practice. To the next practice! Next time. Oh no, we've still got a little bit of practice, but that will be the end once we've done that. Okay, well that's all for this one. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a like on the video. It always helps the channel out. Hit subscribe if you want to keep up to date with future content. That is all from me. See you guys soon.